My grandfather inspired me to get into rocks from as soon as I could remember. He never really forced me into it. He always just said, you, you know, you should get into rocks. My name is Karen Clyke and I'm project geologist at Newfound Gold Corp. I must have been three years old when I started collecting rocks and bringing them home. My grandfather would call me in from outside, but I would stay for hours. He was a miner in Sudbury for most of his life in the mine rescue and mine safety. I actually have his hard hat. It's right there. So. <laughs> When I took an elective in university for earth science, I sort of had a whole bunch of flashbacks of just my grandfather's hard hat at his house and like the rocks that he had lying around. Everything just clicked. And then I learned that every rock really has its own story. It's definitely exciting to see the rocks come in and when you find gold, of course, it's always exciting. I think it's exciting just discovering the habit of the rocks themselves and, and the contacts between them and, and just building the picture of what's beneath our feet. That's lining up quite nicely. And then we have the underwater quartz boulders that everyone's excited about. We could be here for a while. The property that Newfound Gold has claims is quite extensive. We've been expanding the drilling around the Keat zone, so we've done some 10-meter step-outs, and we've also done some 50-meter step-outs. So that is expanding our known presence of the ore body, so that's very exciting. I always enjoyed nature and science, and when my grandfather told me about getting to rocks, I listened and I heard him. My grandfather would be very proud of me and excited. I think he always imagined having a grandson in the mining industry, but now he has a granddaughter. 